So here's a demo on how to remotely uh, connect to a, an SDR radio. Uh, we're going to use SDR console and they have a website v2.sdrspace.com that's v2.sdrspace.com where you get the instructions and links to downloading the software. It's about 88 megabytes. Um, pretty straightforward to, to download. Um, because that's the, uh, the user interface that you'll need. Uh, on this v2sdrspace.com and it's refreshed every 10 seconds, uh, you get a full list of all the stations around the world that are available and whether or not uh, they're in use. Um, so obviously you need to find one that's idle. Some of these have multiple radios, um, but the one we're going to look at today is the um, RSP from SDR um, uh, from uh, SDR Play, and here you see it here, SDR Play RSP, and that's located in the UK. So once you've downloaded and installed the software. Um, the way to uh, to get it up and running is to uh, go to Remote Connection up in the top left hand corner and then a panel comes up and in fact you can either type the username and password in directly or um, click on the Browse Web and it will take that list that we saw earlier and uh, just double check if there's a green tick that they're uh, up and running and available. Uh, we're going for SDR Play RSP with an HF antenna in the UK, so we double click on there and press connect. You get told then how long you've got in a session. This one's uh, enabled for up to an hour and so you've read that, you can close it and then you press start and we're on uh, 28 megahertz here in the HF bands and it's a uh, Afternoon, it's fairly quiet, but we'll have a quick, uh, quick tune around. Uh, so, uh, hang on, my XYZ 